being addressed all over the country. Zero on zero violence. This is Shannon. Shannon's not our problem. But Shannon is desperate to save her 14-year-old out of control sister, Deanna. There's a mom here. Shannon and Deanna have a mom. Her name's Kim. Where is she? Right she's here. in our audience. Why? Because she's given up on Deanna. Oh. You see, at 14, Deanna insists she's her own boss. She leaves the house at midnight to go have sex with guys. She's failing in school. And when she gets angry, she loves to fist fight. So Deanna's anger is so out of control, she runs, grabbed another teen girl, slammed her into a wall, and split her head open. Now, this is her sister Shannon's party. What? My little sister Deanna means the world to me. I love her so much. I would do anything for her. I would lay down my life for her. I would die for her. I would give her anything she ever needs. A year ago, my little sister Deanna came and visited me. She was getting a fight. She was smoking. She was drinking. And I figured she'd do better in her life. But things hadn't gotten any better. She pushes me. She shoves me. She acts like I'm a nobody. I don't feel like she even loves me like I love her. She broke my heart so bad because that's my sister. That's my whole heart. That's my life. That's my love. And she just, she killed me right there. I don't know how to handle it. Deanna is gone in the middle of the night. She kills me every time she runs away. I don't know if I'm going to get a knock on the door. I don't know if she's dead in the gutter. I don't know if she's been drunk, if she's been raped. I don't want to find her in a morgue. I don't want to find her in a hospital. I don't, I don't know how to get rid of my sister. I just want her to change. That's amazing. You would think the little sister you love would look up to you. She was my best friend. As a child, she was a sweet little thing. I don't know what happened to her. She's completely changed. I don't know if it's the friend she hangs out with, but she treats me like... Look at her. That was my best friend. I told her I have my mom can't because my mom couldn't handle her anymore. Yeah. Why? Why? She doesn't respect me. She doesn't respect herself. So what did you do? I had it with her. I never heard of such a thing. I've had it. I can't, I a can't. mother just leave? No, I didn't leave. You sure she, out? No, she went with her sister after that time. I can't imagine you giving up on her. I mean, I'm not giving up on her. Yeah, you're not? She's giving up on herself. You're not giving up on her? No, I'm not. I'm well, not giving up on her. Get out of the audience and sit no, up No, I'm here. not going to sit up there. Oh, no. Sit up there. No. 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 You can't do that. No, I'm not. I'm not. This is what your sister had to say once. My 
down. I told you once, and I'm going to tell you again. I'm the boss. I make my own rules. When I lived with you, I was smoking weed, getting in the fights, and cussing your dumb ass out. You thought you could send me to live with my sister Shannon, and that I would change? Honey, nothing's changed. I'm still the same. Shannon, I don't give a damn that you're my baby older sister. I'm still smoking weed, still having sex, and dog, still getting in the fights. And you're like, damn thing, you can do about it either. Mommy and Shannon, do I took that girl by her hair, swung her around, and pushed her into the wall? Man, I was proud to pick up her ass. And if you two get in my way, I'm going to do the same to you also. Bottom line is this. You two are nothing but thanks and I make the rules. So get used to it because I'm not going to change. I can't wait to meet Deanna. Here she is. Yeah. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 